In a time past hope, in a world gone to crap, one man had an idea. Here, look, lads. Look what I've found. Calm down, Arthur. There's no point getting excited about anything. The steel mine's closed and we're on the scrappy. It's official. No, but look. Earn big pounds playing cricket. Well, it sounds fine, Arthur. But cricket, here in Yorkshire, don't talk soft. Did I hear someone say cricket? <laughs> That's a word I've not heard in a long time. What would you know about cricket? I only used to coach the Manchester United team. <laughs> the year they won the European Cricket Cup. But to us, you, you seem like some mad old drunk. That's the other thing about me. Apart from knowing about cricket, it was the ashes. I could have won them, but I bowled a wide. <laughs> You bowled a wide in the Ashes final? How can you live with your sen? I <laughs> know! Uh, Enter the Ashes, you lot. You taking the piss. Why not? Arthur's a dab and with a silly mid on, and Pete can do follow ons like no one's ever seen. Come on, let us enter. We got stumps in us blood. Oh, you won't be talking like that when you have to face the West Indies in the second round. They've won the Ashes every year since they beat the Dallas Cowboys in 1978. Well, we'll just have to practice our catching and throwing and penalties and that. Run! Run! Ten! Nine! Come on, lads! You've got to back more! But the bat is so narrow, it's perverse! Ah! First rule of cricket, never call the bat narrow. <laughs> what the bat is, is very, very wide and very, very short. <laughs> wow. <laughs> now, carry on bowling and try and do that thing with your hand and your wrist where you make it bounce funny. <laughs> Underdogs, but anyone who saw them beat Yugoslavia at cricket in the semis by 400 wickets to seven runs, all of it for eight, will know that they're not to be underestimated. And West Germany, famously a bunch of cheats. As ever. It looks like we're about to lose. I want to tell you a story. I knew a young man who had a dream. A dream to win the Ashes. That young man was me. But he bowled a wide and became a drunk. That is, I bowled a wide and became a drunk. So don't do that! Now it's your turn to be the team that stands in pairs with the bats rather than the ones in a sort of spread out crowd chucking it around. So make the most of that. And remember, there's no such thing as a draw in cricket. <laughs> What a run. This summer, from the location manager of Billy Elliot and the catering staff who brought you the full Monty. Yes! Remember what they taught you! No! No, not that! I was wrong! Featuring someone who was very nearly in Brassed Off comes a film to touch the child in all of us, but not in that way. and sandwiches onto the pitch. They think it's tea. It is now. And this is for the ashes. I can't believe they've done it. They've actually done it. 
10 cinemas this summer, the full number of overs that are scheduled to be bowled that day. And remember, lads, it isn't over until the full number of overs that are scheduled to be bowled that day.